here so welcome guys come on in come on into my empty house store yes guys come on in my long-awaited house store is here <laughs> so home stylers where i'm standing right now of course it's my entryway so this is my front door and one of the things that i love about my front door are these beautiful crown molding because it makes the space look custom yes of course my mother did go ahead and throw in Race for me, but if you come to my right over here, this is a flex room, and yes, I can use this as an office, but I really think I'm going to turn this into a formal conversation room, okay? Um, maybe I'll do a feature wall here, you know, nice rug, and just kind of make this space a really nice uh, keeping room slash conversation room. And I also love these beautiful large double window that we have right here. I absolutely love these archways, home stylers, and I, and I love the pink colors as well. If you come to my left over here, this is the dining area. And again, my builder went ahead and gave me an upgrade for this room as well. So you see these beautiful chair molding here and this absolutely gorgeous comfort ceiling. Love, love, love my ceilings, home stylers in the dining area. And again, we have this beautiful double picture window right here in the front of the house. Love it. And of course, I'm going to go ahead and change out this chandelier. I already have one picked out, so I cannot wait for you guys to see that. And if you look down, I love my vinyl flooring. These are luxury vinyl flooring. So I love how they continue throughout my first floor. If you follow me through here, this was also an upgrade um, that my builder threw in for us. This home came with quite a few upgrades. So one of those upgrades were my staircase with the spindles and the stained wood railing right here. Yes, I have carpet on my staircase, but I'm gonna go ahead later on and change those out but for now it's nice and clean and I'm just gonna leave it like that also one of the changes that I want to make is to this uh, uh, light fixture right here I'm not a fan of the boob lighting so that's definitely gonna get changed pretty soon and if you follow me here is the main living area home stars yes so this is the living area and of course this is my fireplace. This right here is the manual for my fireplace and it comes with those remotes so I can turn it on. It's not hooked up yet because it's a gas fireplace, um, but this is the this is the manual for that. And I absolutely love how this is built with all the details around my fireplace. Then again, right here we have the beautiful double windows that's continuing throughout my main level. I know a lot of natural light is gonna come in for filming from through these uh, windows. Then we come into the kitchen. We have a nice island right here. Um, in the future, I'm planning on extending this island, but for now, this is the one that came with the house. And I absolutely love these um, hanging up lighting. I don't know if I'll change it out anytime soon, home style, because I kind of like how they are right now. The style of this is kind of my style as well. Very chic, modern, um, uh, pendant like. So I think those are going to stick around for a while. Um, we do have a quartz countertop. Of course, it's white, like my cupboards. And I also opted for some white brick backsplash. So that's what I have going on in the kitchen. White cupboards, brick backsplash, and a beautiful white quartz countertop. These I need to seal home styler, and I will do that before I even move in because I don't want anything to stain my quartz countertop. But I love it. I also love my Kuzlik, um faucet here. Well, there's no water on right now, but it's definitely um, versatile. So I like the sweetness of it. And if you come around here, here's my microwave and my stove and everything is brand new and looking so good, ready for me to come in here and shake it up, you know what I mean? Uh, but yeah, this is um, my microwave here and of course my stove and right there I have my dishwasher and there's lots of covered space home stylers, even though I know I'm going to fill these up pretty quickly. 
Um, these are also soft close um, doors, so I'm loving that. The drawers aren't soft close though, but all the all the uh, all the covered doors are soft close. As you can see, it's taking very <laughs> little time to close, but I'm loving that. They're not slammed. And uh, here is my refrigerator, double door refrigerator. Really nice, um, straightforward fridge. Has the ice maker and everything here. And then over here is my pantry. Um, this pantry is underneath the staircase, so I am losing a little bit of a head space up here. But it's still pretty deep, and they also went ahead and gave me some shelvings to start with. So I thought that was pretty cool of them to do. Um, so yeah, we're definitely going to fill this up with some food <laughs> really soon. And then also, we have this entrance right here that we can go from the kitchen to the dining area. So I am loving that I don't have to walk all the way around to enter into my dining area. Love this. I feel like in the future, I'm going to get this. I'm going to um, do like a little butler's pantry right here, cut it out and maybe put a cupboard or something right here. But I love that I have the access straight from my kitchen and into my dining area. Then back here, come on, come on, come on, I should have. Back here we have like a little landing area. This is um, the door right here goes to the garage. And then we have a guest bathroom right over here. We have one sink, toilet, and a beautiful tub shower combination. And I love the floors. At first, home stylers, I hated these floors. I did not like it. I picked it. And when I saw the installation, it didn't look like a sample. And I was like, this is too busy. I didn't really like it, but it grew on me. So now I don't mind it. <laughs> so I think everything in here look, is looking really nice. And then here's my guest bedroom. It's pretty straightforward, nice size room to put a bed and a nightstand for my guests. Those are gonna be changed out as well. And it has a closet right behind here. A nice size walk-in closet. Um, my husband is debating uh, to get this room, but we'll see because I'll show you where his space is supposed to be. Um, so yes, that's the guest bedroom and I think, can we open this? This is a two car garage. So I have lots of space to fill because trust me, I'm going to need all the space I can get. Um, they're still not finished with all of the things that they need to do with this house. They still have to paint this door and put the locks on there, which I think that's what these are. But now we're going to go upstairs and towards the bedrooms. So in the future, home stylers, I'm definitely planning on um, changing this wall, this half wall right here, and putting some of that spindle that you see downstairs on the stairway. I'm definitely going to be taking this wall down and opening it, and opening it up a little bit more. Um, but come on, we're going to go, let's do this bedroom first. I believe this is the bedroom that my daughter, you guys know Larissa, I believe this is the one she picked. She's in school now, um, but this is the room that she picked, right babe? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so this is going to be Larissa's room. Um, has a nice window over there. And then this is her closet. Again, we walked around and put the tapes, put some yellow tapes and all the little scuff marks. Anyway, this is Larissa's closet door. And this is her room. And of course, that's getting changed, like I said. We have a couple nice recess lights in the hallway upstairs. Yes. And this is another one of the bedrooms straightforward basically the same as Larissa's room nice size closet right here one upstairs has carpet so then this this is the guest bed actually before we hit that we have a nice linen closet right here so I love that one, two, three, four shelves, plus some space on the bottom and on the top. I absolutely love these interior doors, home stylers. I just think they're a little bit more than basic interior doors that you get with some of these builders. So I like that my door has some detailing on it. And here is the guest bathroom. 
So this bathroom is gonna serve all of upstairs, um, except the master, of course. So it has a nice big uh, mirror here, one sink, toilet, and it also has the tub shower combination. Same kind of flooring up here as well, and same interior door. This is the next bedroom. So all together upstairs have four bedrooms. This is a five bedroom home. And so this is the common bedroom that we toured. This is gonna be the fourth bedroom. And pretty standard like the others. You have a nice size closet. You have a window here, it's carpeted. Um, this, is either, this will either be my oldest daughter Shania or Ashley's room. And I think you guys have seen Ashley already. So next, we're gonna come through here and we're gonna walk a little bit further so look down the hallway. Okay, home starters. So now I'm entering through these double doors, my bonus room. So again, beautiful double windows back here. I think we're either gonna use this for Dwight's man cave or maybe like a TV slash game room. He also likes the room downstairs, so we haven't decided if we're gonna use this as a man cave or his uh, or the or the bonus room. So we have that to fight over later. <laughs> anyway, so this is a really nice size room, and then we come out up here and then make a left. We have this little string here goes to the attic, but I'm not gonna pull that down right now. But we also have some uh, storage area up there as well. And then to my left here, we have the laundry room. So you guys are gonna get some content on how I'm gonna make over this laundry room, but right now it's pretty basic. You have your um, washer dryer hookup and a nice little shelf here, and that's about it. I did go ahead and pick a different floor and for in here. Um, still keeping it neutral, but it's a little bit different from the other bathroom. Okay, home seller, so we leave the laundry area and we enter the primary bedroom. Come on. So this is the primary suite. It's a really nice size room, home stylers. I have nice cathedral ceilings, and I have three windows on the other side. So I absolutely love this space and I can't wait to see. I have so many ideas, so I just wanna get the furniture in to see what the possibilities are because in my head I have a lot of ideas and I want to see you know, how it's all gonna fit and come together. So this is my master bedroom and then this is gonna be my master bathroom or my primary bedroom. I'm trying not to say master, um, but this is a primary bedroom and I'm definitely gonna be changing those light fixtures out um, and I'm, I might change this mirror as well and put two uh, vanity mirrors over here. But for now, this is how it's gonna be. Um, again, same tile floor, same kind of floor, which I'm absolutely loving. And I love my garden tub home styler. It's a really nice size. I can now soak in my garden tub. Then we come over here and we have a door to the water closet. And then beside that, we have my husband and I's closet. So it's, it's not very wide, but it's definitely deep and a lot of space for both of us. So I'm really liking this closet. I'm probably gonna need to do some organization in here, but that's, that will come with time. And over here beside my beautiful garden tub, picture window here, but there's no one behind me. So I don't have to worry about my neighbors. <laughs> and plus it's upstairs. So if anyone's looking through, they're perverts. <laughs> anyway, so Sarah, here is my walk-in shower, which I love. Didn't have one of these in my first home. So I cannot wait to come in here and take my shower, you know, by myself. <laughs> I'm going to be changing out my shower head and eventually further in the future, oops, further in the future, I want to upgrade to a frameless door, shower door. 
but definitely love my bathroom glow sink and I have a lot of storage here. Also love the same, love the flooring. It's the same ones that were in the other two bathrooms. So yes, home sellers, let's go back downstairs. Okay, I want you guys to let me know what y'all think about my empty house tour. Um, I just cannot wait. I'm getting excited to just fill this space up with some beautiful furniture and more importantly, some love, okay? I hope you guys see that I'm rocking my Satoya's Home and Lifestyle t-shirt. Do you like my design? In the comment section so I can know your thoughts. Anyways, you'll come to the end of my empty home tour. Um, let me know in the comment section what y'all think. Stay blessed, home stylers, and until next time, later.